hello navigator today in this video i am going to show you about the weekly updates of challenger software and also weekly updates in eggdis this is for aio and avcs weekly update so without wasting time let's get into the video these are the mails i receive every week this is aio avcs 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 and enp weekly updates also i receive adp weekly updates as well but for the time being i am not interested to show you about the enp so let me put it other way around and let's go to aio this is only one part so part one of one for avcs there are three parts so one of three two of three and three of three these are the mail so i have to go to the mail and i have to copy the mail attachment and then i have to put it in a directory folder and for here i always choose in c drive challenger and email data so i'm putting it here so one is done another one i have to open copy and then put in email data abcs weekly update part 2 copy email data paste then again the last one part 3 copy and then email data paste so all the email attachment are available here now so let's go to challenger now and the primary dashboard is like this you have to update the data so here you can see a sign updated data email update window once you choose this one you can load you can choose the load email data it will load automatically completed and the pop-up information is here you can see info update is completed this is how you can do weekly update of your challenger now from challenger you have to take the update you have to create the update from challenger to update your egg disk and to create your update you have to go to electronic charts and here you can see create update create update okay so let's do it create update you have to choose the week set week set is 18 last week 18 to 18 even if you want to do all the weeks that means not applied this will include all the updates but you don't need all the updates you need only for the last week because from because you are continuously updating it so only last week is enough generate Before going to generate, I am showing you AVCS. This is this will generate only AVCS. Then put yes and then go. Six updates were found and extracted. I am showing how you will see it. You will see it like this. Now let's generate AIO for this week. Then again choose go to AIO and then choose week set. Then choose the week and then generate one updates were found and extracted this is the aio so aio and avcs both you have got the updates for your egg disk now you must have the dedicated uh, dedicated egg disk uh, pen drive so this one i'm putting it you can copy this updates latest update and take it into your pen drive okay now let's go to egg this as you understand this is the egg this uh, update i have taken in my flash drive or usb drive and for this is my backup egg this and the other terminal is my master egg disk but this update 
uh, is not required separate for master and for backup or for backup for master this is same so this is just weekly updates eio and avcs i have received and i can put it here the same thing i can put it there i mean for this terminal and that terminal is same updates no need separate uh, extract from the challenger terminal and then go to your menu and go to code input then you will see this window this pop-up window will come and then choose for chart maintenance here once you go to chart maintenance then go to import update charts not the first one first one is for license key for the cell and this one is weekly update import or update charts so here then this is enc you are doing the enc update not arcs not cmap so go to enc then i always choose automatically and here i direct the path direct the path i mean uh, i have to show that flash drive here and i can do avcs fast or aio fast that doesn't matter at all i, I choose avcs and then press ok and you can see automatically flash drive already shown and then choose this automatically all then the updates will start automatically and it will complete after certain time it doesn't take much time at all anyway then we have completed for avcs now go to browse and then direct aio choose aio then press ok then again select automatically do you import or update all charts once the update is complete then press ok and get back to your general window or i mean the navigation window that's it this is how you can do your weekly update so once you finish the job you can go back to your primary window or primary display of route planning route monitoring so check out the usb flash drive and do the same thing for another terminal this is my master like this and i can do the same here i also hope you will be benefited from this video once you need it thank you so much for watching